Hi everyone. How are you guys doing? Me? I have been being a bit lazy since I came back from Miami. And that's going to stop right now. We're going to go for a walk. We must go for a walk. Let's not sit. I've been sitting. I have been sitting, you guys. Ladies and gents, I've been sitting. Sedentary. Just sitting. Uh, I'm just like, that's not good. It's time to get up. And it's time to walk. It's time to challenge ourselves again. <laughs> we cannot just sit. So I was like, okay. I've done what I've been wanting to do, which is basically chillax. But I was like, bitch, if you don't keep walking, you already know what's going to happen. And I'm like, yeah, I ain't going to let it happen. Yep, I sure do. I got me a tostonera from Miami. Just to flatten out my plantains. I said, tostones, tu me entiendes. I forgot the stair thing or whatever, the step thing or whatever. I don't care. We're going to walk. No, I cannot stay seated. I did it for three days. I was like, girl, I know I got this. I don't know if it's from the medication that I'm taking. Because you guys know I'm taking medication for my stomach. I'm on an antibiotic. So I already took it. Oh, I had to take it three times a day. So my husband was like, take it at... Nine, two, you know, ten, whatever. But I have to take it three times a day, so it's a little bit com kind of cumbersome. But it's a ten day, ten day uh, medication, and then I should be fine. So let's walk. Good morning, hello. We haven't been out for a while. Time to get back out. So we called the police over yesterday. The police came over and uh, we told them about the incident of the phone with the Google, just a whole bunch of things. So we'll see what happens with that. Good morning. He's like, wow, that's crazy. He says it happens a lot. But he, you know, he came over, talked with me and my husband, you know? And then he said, I sounded like Sofia Vergara. <laughs> I was like, okay. <laughs> Ooh, look at this worm. Look at the earthworm. If you're going fishing, it'll be a perfect day. So, it's not this month. Next month is my son's birthday. Oh, I'm so excited. He'll be 25 years old. He's decided that he wants to have um, asado, an asado at the at the park. There's a place that he knows about. He's like, Mom, it's so far away. He's like, it's an hour away. He's like, but it's a perfect place for like barbecue or whatever. And he said it's really nice. I was like, it's just an hour away. He's like, yeah. I was like, let's go. He's like, really? I was like, but of course. It's your birthday. We're going. So I don't know where. 
the location is, but it's an hour away from where we live. And so I'm like, hey, vamos, vamos, vamos. So, um, I'm excited. I get more excited for my son's birthday than I do for my own. I'm like, you're 25. Then I try to remember what I did at 25. And, you know, talk to him, though, my, my son. He's like, Ma, you got ripped off. How did you do that, Ma? Why didn't you call me, Ma? He's like, Ma, you're not going to get that money back, Ma. I was like, I know, son. <laughs> it's like I talked to my son. I'm like, son. He's like, Ma. No, Ma. <laughs> he's too funny. I was like, he's like, you should have called me. He's like, I did call you. You didn't answer. He's like, oh. <laughs> Don't be pressured by anybody. Go get Google Play cards. Hell no. It's a scam. I don't know why my throat's like that. I got my cardinal bird feeders at the other house. I gotta go check on that today. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Fine, how are you? Have a blessed day. You Thank you. Oh yeah, people got bird feeders out there with red stuff. Red stuff? I don't know what that red stuff is. I gotta get home and make a new bird feeder water for my hummingbirds, which is sugar and water. You have to boil it to make like a syrup, and then you can put it inside of the bird feeder. So, <laughs> yeah. Look, here goes a heart from Nick Nick. Yeah, I got this um, boy down in my mouth. I'm like, oh. Probably go to Dollar Tree, see what I could find, some CarMax or whatever. Because where I'm going is the co-ops. Too expensive to buy stuff there, but. <laughs> The weather in Durham is beautiful though. Whew. The breeze is great. Just one foot in front of the other. That's what we do, darlings. Agale, arriba. Now I'm very happy to say that los indocumentados. Ahora pueden tener licencia acá en Carolina del Norte. Hell yeah. The undocumented people can now have a driver's license here in North Carolina. Yes. I love it. So my friends can drive. But no problem. That way they don't have to worry about nothing. El retén. They don't have to worry about retén. Uh. I know, every time I'm making a video, everybody... Sorry. Making my video. <sighs> my husband just called. <laughs> Not now, before. And, uh... He gets off at work soon. So, babe, I was like, by the time you get home, I'll already be walked, showered, and ready to be with you. And today we're going to go mail out the gift to Abigail Navarro. Today's the day, Abigail. Wish. Nick, Nick, wish. Yeah.
three days without walking. I was like, fuck this shit. Do it up. Y'all know where I'm going to. The co-op. Y'all can meet me at the co-op. Y'all see my face? Told you the beach would clear it up. Clear, thank God. Hallelujah. So my husband went to the pantry yesterday for us. He got some killer strawberries. So of course, you know, I gotta put the strawberries in my water. So good, you guys. I know. Gotta get rid of all that phlegm. The mierda. That's what you do, you walk out and you give yourself a cleansing from the inside out, you know? Yep, yeah, so my next thing is my baby's uh, 25th. I'm gonna, we're gonna give him a passport for his birthday, you know? I'm like, son, once you get a job and you're working, they will put you on the flight list. But first, we'll give you the passport so that you can have an incentive to get a job and save money, son. So you can travel with us. He's like, okay, mom, he likes that idea. He's my baby, honey. He might be 25, but I don't care if he's 45. He's still gonna be my boy, my baby boy. <laughs> That's just the way that goes. I'm a mama for life. So they're my babies for life. Tell you what, what's been saving my stomach? Sourdough bread, yo. Ain't gonna lie. Pickles, pepperoncini's been saving my stomach, yo. Brown and cut. Huh. Oh, tomato. Brandy wine. How beautiful, beautiful. How lovely. You guys already know I love strawberries. They have jelly. <laughs> Honey toffee peanuts, I love peanuts. Ooh. Sliced almonds, those are the bomb, baby, bomb, bomb, bomb. Organic white rice. Call up, look at this. Organic white rice. I don't know, but I'm gonna try that. Organic white long, huh? I've never done this, you guys, so I'm gonna see what. 
how, what do you do? So, <laughs> oh, oh, that's very simple. Just pull it down. Okay. Oh, hey, let's try it. Okay, so you gotta pull this down. We're gonna try the organic, right? Um, organic rice, coconut, almond flour, I see the almond flour. Well, we're going to take this. I'm going to take the arroz, because you guys know that I'm like a rice lover. We have, um, yeah. We have pork chops, except I don't like pork chops per se, like I do, but I don't. I know it's kind of weird, but I am weird. Just how that goes. This is ground beef, grass-fed ground beef. That I love. I have fit the cheese at the house, which is fantastic. Because I could make a cadillo at the house, you know, like they did for us when we were in Miami. And we absolutely loved it, the picadillo. Of you fresh butter, what? Oh my freaking gosh! Well, let's see what else can we do here. You know what I was looking at? Cream of wheat. Oh my gosh. Somebody was making cream of wheat and I was like, Philly Boy J. I don't know if y'all know Philly Boy J, but he is like so cool. Although he hasn't made anything in like three years. I remember him since before I had my YouTube channel. And I was like, oh wow, this guy's really cool. And, um, and I was like, I made his, his stuff before, yo. I don't know where you at, Philly Boy J, but it, it, when you do make a comeback, I'll be happy to see you again. Philly Boy J. Uh, Honey nuts. I'm trying to see if maybe some good organic cereal would be good, you know. Raisin bran. Organic raisin bran. Eh. Eh. Heritage flakes. Corn fruit juice. Corn flakes. Organic wheat squares. Coconut chia, almond cereal. For some reason, they just don't sound that good to me. Puff rice, eh. Cocoa bunnies, eh. Maple pecan crunch. Golden turmeric, no. Sweetened wheat fulls. think so not too I'm all like eh like yes and then like totally no 
like I said, some of these crackers you can get cheaper at the Dollar Tree. I'm very aware of that, so that's why I'm like, mm, you know. <laughs> like four ninety nine for a bag of chips is not gonna happen. It's just not gonna happen. That's crazy. Okay, guys, I'm going to let you go so I can think here, but uh, thanks for walking.